This is Cortese di Gavi, 2011, from Pio Cesare. Of course, um, you know, we know Pio Cesare uh, as a really, really fine producer of uh, Barolos. But uh, he makes an array of wines, all from the Piedmont region in northern Italy. And, you know, Gavi is probably the most famous, most well-known white wine from that region. Uh, the grape variety is Cortese. They grow there. And, you know, it has a nice um, bright fruit character, um, good acidity naturally, and it can take on some, some richness um, if, it's, if it's handled properly. They source the grapes for this wine from uh, hillside vineyards right in, in the Gavi region, um, from family-owned vineyards uh, that they've contracted with for a very, very long time. So uh, they're very hands-on as far as the farming and how the grapes are grown, so they know what they're getting. All stainless steel fermentation. Um, the wine is uh, temperature control fermented, and then it sits on the lees for four months. So that brings uh, another layer to the wine. It gives it a little bit of richness, a little bit of fuller body. Um, and it gets uh, a little bit of malolactic, which uh, makes it softer. Anyway, really um, pretty fruit notes, floral notes um, like uh, jasmine. I get a little white peach, and I get some delicious, uh, golden, delicious apple. Pear, these are all really nice, nice bright white wine aromas. Let's taste. So, really nice and tangy. I mean, there's a good, um, real nice backbone of acidity to this wine. Makes it juicy, makes it mouth-watering. But then on the mid-palate, it's, it's soft and it's, and it's rich. And you get more of that, um, those pear, those white peach notes that are very, very appealing. Um, it's a wine that can go with veal or with seafood. Um, you know, and match up nicely with either of those because it has that richness and it has that really good backbone of acidity. Enjoy.